Justin Rice, thanks for a $5 super chat. Any guides on DIY 8S batteries instead of using two 4S batteries? Justin, I guess my question to you would be, why is the process of building your own pack by, by, by spot welding tabs on cells and yada, 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 why is that more appealing to you than just building a damn series adapter for two 4S batteries? Right? Everybody I know, and I'm not going to say it's everybody in the world, but everybody I know who runs 8S or 12S quadcopters just has two batteries in series. And they have a series adapter. What's wrong with that solution? It makes charging simpler. You're going to have to get an 8S charger. They do exist. But why not just use 4S batteries? Size reasons. How much size are you saving, Justin? I don't believe you. I'm skeptical. Because like Justin, think about it. Hang on. Now, I... I'm going to make myself look like an idiot because there's something about Justin's build that, I mean, obviously he knows his own damn build. So what, who am I to criticize? But here is a 6S battery. Here is a 6S battery. I would like to make a 12S battery. Okay, so I'm going to peel the coating off them. I'm going to separate them all out. I'm going to desolder, whatever. I'm going to put them together. And what have I got in the end? I'll have a 12S battery. It's the exact same size. It's the same number of cells. If I want a 12S, 1,000 milliamp hour, that's how big it's going to be. Right? So I'm, uh, the only thing I'm saving is the weight and size of the XT60 lead. And at the end, I've got a 12 cell battery that I can't charge on any charger, except like one 12S charger that I spent too much money on. So like, I don't see how this weight and size of this XT60 is gonna be the thing that like breaks you when it comes to your build. Uh, and that's why no one does that. But maybe you got a special reason why you really want to do that. That's the other thing, Justin. Let's let's say you let's say you so how would you I'm gonna to try to answer your question because I've I actually have a policy where generally if you ask me what I think is a weird or dumb question, like you wanna do something dumb, I'm I, I'm mostly just gonna to try to answer your question and help you out, unless what you're trying to do is dangerous, you know, or harmful. But in this case, like I, I I don't know. It's not dangerous or harmful. We're just shooting the shit. Um, if you did want to do this, you would want to find a source for b individual cells. You would want to buy whatever, 3,000 milliamp hour cells. And you would get naked cells from a manufacturer. You could probably buy them on, let's guess that you can buy them on. Let's see if you could buy them on AliExpress. Let's see. I don't know. I can buy anything on AliExpress, right? Lipo cells. Oh, hell yeah. All right. Now, uh, what milliamp hours do I want? I don't know. Uh, 12S, 1,000 milliamp hours, 2,000 milliamp hours. Let's try 12S, 2,000 12, 2, milliamp hour cells. Uh, here's a 2,000 milliamp hour. Let's try and, let's try and dial it down a little more. Uh, 100C. Can we get, can we get anything? No, we're out of luck. No, now we just got batteries. So where can I buy bare lipo cells? See, I'm getting individual batteries. That's the problem. What's the keyword to buy individual naked lipo, lipo cells? Try eBay. Oof, you better watch out pulling up an eBay search history. Luckily, this was just a power supply and not that special massager I built. I bought. I, I bought. <laughs> um, no, again, I'm just getting batteries. 
So what you would want to do is you would want to source individual cells. I don't know where you could do that. I would bet if you reached out to like CNHL and you said, I want to buy cells, they would have some, you know, if you spent $500 on cells from CNHL, maybe they'd sell you some bare cells. They probably would. Um, oh, that's interesting. 1400 million power one S let's try it. Just searching for a one S. That's a good, that's a good suggestion. Yeah, but you're not going to find a 100C. No. So what I would do is I would go to CNHL. You could always salvage cells from individual packs, but that's not, that doesn't scale well. If you're trying to actually build packs to use, you're going to want to have a process you can repeat. Um, lipo batteries. Can we, do we have a contact us? Do we have like a contact us? Customer service Q and A. No, contact us. Damn it. It was right there. Contact us. Okay. So I would go here and I would say name Joshua Bardwell, etc. I'm not going to put that stuff in. Hi, I would like to purchase some 1s cells to build my own packs do you do well do you do uh, direct to consumer sales and what is your MOQ the specific cell I'm looking for is 1s 100c uh, 1000 million power thank you I would do something like that uh, and then I would also reach out to GNB. I would reach out to GNB. I would reach out to, well, I'm not going to be able to find GNB. Where, where's GNB? Uh, Gowning, that's it. I would go to GNB. They'll make batteries for anybody. You should, I bet, I, I would bet you GNB will work with you. Company, da, 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 friendly link, Alibaba. They got a phone number. Oh, here. So I would email Nicole Fang at gowningbattery.com and I would say, hi, Nicole, my name is so-and-so. I want to build my own custom 12S batteries. These are for personal use, not for resale. Uh, can you tell me the quantity, the minimum quantity? Uh, and I would try that. Oh, J.R. Bosch has got something for us. Um, J.R. Bosch found 1800 milliamp hour three point. Yeah, but that's only like two C that's 3.6 amp rate for 1800 milliamp. That's like two C that's no good. That's no good for a drone. Yeah. That's how I'd approach this problem. <laughs> All right. Hope that was interesting and helpful. Lipo pillow cell. Eric said, Eric Toff says pillow cell may be the right term. Oh, pillow cell. Yeah, but like you need you need a high C rate. That's the problem. Can we get a hundred C? You need a high C rate. I don't know where you're gonna be able to buy that. Okay. Good question. It's an interesting question. Yeah, the question was about eight S, not twelve S. Sorry, I got a little uh, confused. Um. Okay. Hope you hope you guys enjoyed that.